In this video we're going to look at how to find the nth term of a geometric sequence. So a geometric sequence is one where each new term in the sequence is generated by multiplying the previous term by a constant. So for this first sequence, um, this sequence is grown by multiplying the previous term by 2. So we have our start term which we use the letter A for and we have our common ratio which in this case is 2 as we are multiplying by 2 each time and the nth term of a geometric series or sequence is given by a r to the n minus 1 so we've got our first term <coughs> our second term is multiplied by 2 our third term is multiplied by 2 again our fourth term by 2 again so we're multiplying by 1 fewer 2 then there are up terms in the sequence. So this is 7 multiplied by 2 to the power of n minus 1 <coughs> and that gives us the nth term for our sequence. For this uh, second example we're going to go through the same process so we're going to identify a which is negative 3 and the value of the common ratio r so what are we multiplying by? Um, we're multiplying by negative 3. So this is uh, negative 3 times negative 3 to the power of n minus 1. And because these are both negative 3, we can use um, index laws to simplify that to negative 3 to the power of n. So this third one, we've got a value of a being 50 and a value of r. So what are we multiplying 50 by to get 40? Uh, well, that's 0 0.8. So our nth term is therefore 50 multiplied by 0 0.8 to the n minus 1. And our fourth one, um, we've got a value of a is 2 and a value of r so 2 multiplied by what? well multiplied by 1.5 so we've got 2 times 1.5 to the power of n minus 1 